Hello, and welcome to this Bacon Bits video on deploying apps and scripts as a specific user. We're going to take a look at how to deploy a script, in this case, a batch file to one of our Windows endpoints. So do keep in mind the instructions for Linux and for Mac are very similar. So let's go ahead and get started by going to our repository. And we'll take a look at the script that we're going to deploy. This run as batch file here. Very simple, it's just going to call whoami.exe, and this will tell you what user the session is currently running under. So go ahead and go to Actions, and then Deploy. I'll select my platform as Windows, and I'll choose Launcher here, because I want Bacon to run this file once it places it on the machine. Next up, I'll select my endpoint. And then here under Run As, I want to change this from System to User. So here I can type in my username. Now on Mac and Linux based operating systems, you're not gonna have a requirement for a password, but on Windows we do, so I'll enter that as well. Don't need any executable flags, so I'll just do a deploy immediately. Let's go ahead and take a look at the job itself. This will be pretty quick, but I'll just fast forward and we'll take a look at the end. All right, with our job done, we can now see that it placed the batch file on the machine and that session is currently running as Dave. So this can be applied to any application that you want to install under a specific user, or maybe you're reaching out to network equipment that requires specific credentials. You can use this method as well. Thanks for joining us in this Bacon Bits video, and we'll see you next time.